Today, the verse is 2 Corinthians 4, 18, and it says, So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. Since what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. I definitely love this verse because it points us to what we should focus our mind on, the things that make sense in the long term. In this chapter, the Apostle Paul focuses on how to live by faith, even during challenging circumstances. And this verse is preceded by the description of how God illuminates us humans to know, first of all, that Jesus is God, and second, that there is a spiritual realm, a heavenly kingdom that exists. So the verse points us to where to fix our mind's eyes when things get tough. And you know, the first option here is that there are things that are easily seen but are not really worth seeing. And why? Well, because they're temporary. There's no effort, no glory, no spiritual influence here. But we tend to naturally see them, including sufferings, problems, injustices. And if I can be honest, I have to keep saying to myself that they are temporary. The second option, which is, by the way, the recommended one, is that there are things that we do not naturally focus on. The matters of God and His kingdom. The spiritual and eternal things. So, But to focus on those things with eternal significance, it's only possible with spiritual empowerment that comes from God with his light, power, and hope, then we will be able to get the right perspective on things. In the moment we begin to focus on the eternal, we invite him to take over the circumstances. And you know what? He does it. So I want to invite you to set your eyes upon Jesus. And when you're going through difficult circumstances, be mindful of the spiritual truth of the gospel. God displays there his beautiful promises for your true identity, your spiritual resources, the things that you already have, and the eternal hope that we all have in Him. God bless.